Now this could be part of a power station in a geothermal plant. Effectively what we have is a generator that's turning around to generate electricity. That's being turned by the turbine, which in turn is being turned by uh, steam which is coming out at high pressure. So where does the steam come from? Well if it's a geothermal power station, what we do is we basically drill a hole, or a couple of holes, really far underground. If you then inject cold water, as it gets to the bottom it heats up, it then gets hotter and hotter, turns to steam and comes back out and into the power station which is above ground. So the advantage of this is that you can basically um, just drill some holes, put water in, get hot water out and then we get our electricity. I guess the disadvantage is the fact that it only works in certain parts of the world where you've got the right geography to have hot rocks relatively near to the surface. So places like Iceland are ideal. So when it does work, it's basically a fairly carbon neutral way of generating electricity because you're not able to burn anything. Um, I guess the disadvantage is that it can only work in certain parts of the world and therefore it's not applicable to everywhere. But geothermal, you're basically injecting cold water underground, it comes up hot, and we can then use that to run the rest of our power station in a fairly conventional way.